Okay, Digital Warriors, welcome back. We're moving on with our M1 tutorials in Steel Beast. This is uh, tutorial number six, uh, Gunnery Mission F, and this is working with the tank crew. So, until now, you and the loader have been the only crew members in the tank. Now the tank commander, the TC, and driver will join you. Among other things, the TC designates targets to the gunner, decides which ammo the loader should load, and issues the order to fire. When a target is spotted, the TC will issue a short warning such as Gunner Sabo Tank, or perhaps just Tank. At the same time, the TC will override the gunner and slew the turret towards the target that he wants the gunner to shoot. When the gunner sees the target, he says identified, which is the cue for the TC to give control of the turret back to the gunner. The TC will then issue the order to fire. It is important to realize that when the TC orders a change of ammo type for the gun, the loader will not remove the round that is currently loaded. Once a round is loaded in battle, it should only come out by being fired. However, in rare cases, the TC can order a different type of ammo to be reloaded by double tapping on the appropriate key, which is usually the insert or delete key on the keyboard. The TC indicates that he wants the loader to start loading a different ammo type when he issues the order to fire. For example, he would say fire, fire, heat, instead of just fire. On the M1, the gunner must mentally keep track of what ammo type is currently loaded in the main gun and set the ammunition selection switch to that ammo type. The gunner should also listen to the loader, who will notify the crew when he starts loading a different type of ammo by saying, for example, heat up, instead of his usual up. The setting of the ammunition selection switch is used by the ballistic computer to calculate super elevation and lead. Sabo and heat rounds have very different muzzle velocities and ballistic properties, so setting this switch incorrectly will likely result in a miss. In this tutorial, the TC will designate targets for you to shoot. Pay attention to the ammo type that is being loaded and set the ammunition selection switch appropriately. In Steel Beast, the insert key selects Sabo and the delete key selects Heat by default. You can also set the ammunition type through the menus. Alright guys, so this is probably one of the hardest things uh, for newcomers to Steel Beast to get used to and that's listening to the TC uh, and just the general comms chatter inside the tank and as a gunner knowing which uh, setting to use, whether you use, you know, Sable or Heat, uh, based upon the target. Um, really, based upon the target, you know, APCs and BRDMs, things like that, lightly armed vehicles, you're going to be using Heat Rounds, or the TC is going to want you to use Heat Rounds and, and heavy armor such as tanks and whatnot, you're going to want to use Sable. But if you've got a round loaded inside the barrel and you've got it, uh, you know, set incorrectly the the ballistic computer settings um you're going to miss so you do have to pay attention what uh the comms chatter inside the turret and and what the tc is telling you so we're going to jump in here and uh i'll show you guys what it's all about so we'll go ahead and start we'll jump in the site we'll get on the tiz all right so the tc automatically slewed the uh, the turret uh, he wants a sable round on this tank sable is up by default so we're going to laze we're going to shoot. That's a hit. Alright, he's slewing again. Alright, so PC. Alright. He's going to want a heat round after I launch this sable round. So we'll laze, shoot, switch it down to heat. And you can see up in the upper right, I'm switched to heat. And we're going to hit this one now. Loader said heat's up. And we'll laze, shoot. It's another shot. Make sure to dump that lead. Alright, he wants us to hit this tank next. We've got a heat round loaded in the breach, but we need to expend this uh, heat round and then switch off to Sabo. Alright, he wants us to hit this BRDM. After we shoot this, we've got a hit Sabo round loaded in right now. So after that, we're going to want to load up a heat round here. Alright, so we'll track him. Firing. Got him. Switch it down to heat. He wants us to re-engage him. Alright. We're going to track them. We've got a heat round in. All right. Relays. Fire. Got them. All right. Should be the last target here. We're already on heat. So we're going to get a good lays. Track them. Shoot. That's a miss. Oh, that actually hit him. Cease fire. That's mission. That was good. Uh, good set there. So as you can see, the commands come quick. Uh, so you really have to stay on top of it and pay attention. It does become second nature uh, the longer you do it. So I suggest this is another one of those tutorials that uh, you should really play multiple times just to get used to, to the 
to the commands inside the inside the tank. Um, probably could have got a quicker average time to kill, but I was talking to you guys through it. Um, we were 100%, 7 out of 7. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, that's another important aspect of this game. So I hope you guys are enjoying the series. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye.